Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be unboxing a perfume by the house of Lorenzo Villoresi. A perfume I've had before, a perfume I really love. I think I bought my first bottle back in 2016 or 17, used it up and then never repurchased it again. People used to compliment me on it all the time. Uh, I think it's one of the most beautiful powdery perfumes ever made. But first, let me show you the sample they showed. They gave me. They gave me a sample of this is from from my online order of Yop Om. <laughs> I used to have a bottle of this one. It's this cherry tobacco type of very very annoying fragrance. <laughs> but I'm gonna have to try it again. I have not smelled it in years. Uh, they gave me a sample of what is this? Sisley, yeah. Sisley Hair Ritual, R Revitalizing, what is this? Revitalizing Shampoo, Smoothing Shampoo. Okay, we're gonna give this a try, I guess. Even though I don't like using too many different things, I like to find one product that's, that works well, and then I stick to it. But I'm gonna give it a try. I mean, Sisley is a good brand, right? Allegedly. Okay, and they also gave me a soap. <laughs> the, I don't know, it was their 90 year anniversary. It's a lavender soap. Oh yeah, so this brand, Pipa, this perfume uh, shop, they have a lot of uh, shops all over Germany. Uh, yeah, they started off as a, a soap shop and then they turned into a perfume shop after a while. This is what the soap looks like. It's giving natural cosmetics. It's giving skin dermatitis, contact dermatitis. It's giving skin allergy, I don't know. <laughs> no, but it smells nice. It's a really nice lavender, powder lavender. Nice, I don't really use bar soaps, but yeah. It's nice to have. Now let's get to the main thing, which is the perfume. They gift wrapped it for me. <laughs> I mean, thank you, right? Let's take it out of the box. And it, as you guys have probably already guessed, Tom Dinesh. I have not smelled it in such a long time. I remember loving it and wearing it all the time. It's a very simple white packaging with this uh, silver writing, silver text. What does it have? Yeah, there's also 80, 82%. So it is an auditory light, but it's a very strong one from what I, what I can remember. It's a very strong, long lasting person. Beautiful, though. Let's read what it says. In a lot of different languages. Patchouli. Vintage collection. Let's find English. <laughs> okay. Okay. So there we go. Lor Lorenzo Loresti practices the art of perfumery in his studio overlooking the rooftops of Florence. Florence. Influences of faraway lands give life to original collections of personal fragrances, perfumes, and accessories for the bath and the home. Okay. Sandalo, vetiver, ilang ilang. 
Yerba Mate, this is the one I'm very interested in. Yerba Mate, the scent of grass, new mown hay, herbs and flowers scattered in the fields, fresh green and citrus notes, tea, mate, lavender and mint. Touches of gentle spicy notes. I'm very interested in this one. If you guys try, try this one, let me know in the comments. Yeah. Now let's... Let's get it out of the box. So I had a 50 ml previously. So this is the 100 ml. It's a very simple, simple bottle, but it's really nice, isn't it? It's this frosted glass. Let's spray it on. It's been a while. Oh. <laughs> powder, sweet. Mm. There's a lot of tonka bean in this one. I don't think there's vanilla in here. The sweetness, the sweetness is coming from this very sweet, sugary type of tonka bean. It's kind of soapy, very smooth, very smooth. Ah, powder, powder, powder. It's powder, but it's not heavy and it's not suffocating. There is this lightness and sheerness to it, but it definitely has a body to it, if you know what I mean. It's, it's a long lasting, powerful fragrance, but it's very gentle and soft at the same time. That's what makes it really interesting. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. It's a beautiful perfume. It's this rosy iris, rose iris mix with some, it's de definitely a lot of musk in there, it's, but it's a very smooth, soft musk, clean musk. And then you get this sweet tonka in the in the base there might be a little bit of vanilla in there but yeah beautiful so happy to have it back in my collection so yeah that's it for this video you guys tom de neige by lorenzo Villoresi. Villoresi. beautiful powder perfume thank you for watching bye